Hey guys, shoutouts to Brian Reyes for sending me this deck profile, I really appreciate it. He beat me around 7 making me X2, but you know what, it's all good, I'm glad he got his top. Thank you so much again for sending me the deck profile, and I hope you guys enjoy. Alright, uh, what's up guys, I'm Brian Reyes, a uh, new player for E-Man Games here. Uh, we're at Los Angeles Regionals, this is my boy Kenny, uh, last year's world's competitor. <laughs> yep. and, um, we just finished last round of Swiss. We unfortunately had to play each other. We yeah. both lost uh, round we one. We played card for card. Yeah, yeah we made it to the last round of Swiss yeah. and we played the same list. Yeah. And this is actually Mirko Zanelli's list, my new teammate, uh, who just won YCS London. I played his list card for card. Uh, thank you, thank you so much to you, Mirko, for helping me out this morning uh, with the theory. It helped a lot. It came in clutch in the, in the tournament. Um, but yeah, let's just get into the deck. So yeah, so we played three Ray, three Ash, and the last hand we played was three Bell. Uh, like, People have been starting to play this card because people like it plays around Midbreaker, but nobody's playing Midbreaker now because everybody's playing hand traps to play around Midbreaker. But this card's still just in general good because like I was able to hit Firewall when they were trying to add back three monsters twice today, and because of that I was able to win. And this card has implication versus like other decks versus the mirror. It could stop Ray from summoning back, or it could stop them from adding back engage. Um, and like against Trickstar, I played a few Trickstar today. You could just stop them from using the reincarnation to summon. So I think this card's really good. Yeah, this is like the best one that like all over around but like you can play other cards like cherries and like droll and stuff but they're very matchup specific mm -hmm. this is the only all around best one so that was really good yeah bell was really good so that's it for the monsters there's nine monsters uh for the sky striker spells played three engage uh three widow anchor uh three area zero uh three multi roll uh a lot of people just play two multi roll and they'll play two area zero but like you need to you need to get to Ray. Like if you get to Ray, you you should be in control of that matchup 100. percent And by playing three multi roll and three area zero, the you, you you're like playing the most consistent deck as possible to see Ray turn one. And then multi roll is just so good in the mirror match that playing three is just really good. You always want to have uh like you always want to have your opponent under your multi roll in the mirror. That's why this card's really good. Yeah, um, it's better to hard draw this than to search it. That's why you want to play three. Yeah, 100. Yeah, yeah, it's like the main reason behind it. Uh, two Ego Booster. I think like this card's insane. Like it won me a lot of matches today. And if Sky Striker was more popular, I'd probably play three because this card's just that good. But I think yeah. it's fine at two with a like uh, such a diverse format right now. Yeah, there's a lot of like new decks, especially with the FTK now. You definitely don't want to like this is like the worst one to draw as like a one of. I mean, as like a brick, but only, it's only good against like the mirror, of course. And like yeah, with the FTK now, it's like you don't want to draw too many of like cards like that. Yeah, and so for the one ofs, we played uh, Hornet Drones, Afterburners, Shark Cannon. Uh, and Hercules base. So I like to say that I'm not good enough to play without this card because I don't know how to manage my resources well enough. I think this card is just really good. Yeah. It's like, the thing is, if you get like three spells or, or, or more engraved and you activate this, even against the mirror, like attacking into a sky, like a link, they're gonna have to, you're gonna get the draw and then they're gonna summon Ray and you're still gonna have to attack into it and you're still gonna get another draw. Like, I think the correct play is to like not summon Ray, but then like not summoning Ray is just bad. So like, this is like always good. I think. Yeah, I think this card's really good. A lot of people give me like crap for saying this card's good, but you people are dumb. <laughs> but, I, I think, yeah, it's all good, I think yeah. this card's good, but that's it for no jamming waves because this format isn't like isn't a jamming waves format. I mean, we have uh, the oh FTK, well, so much FTK and so much Goki, Goki in America. Too, yeah. I think uh, main decking jamming waves just isn't worth it right now. No. But uh, so yeah, that's it for the Sky Striker spells. And now just for generic spells, we played um, mm. two terraforming uh, for more consistency. Same reason why we played three multi roll, three area zero. Uh, like honestly, in my opinion, these are like the best cards in my deck. Uh, this card, this yeah, insane. these cards are really, really yeah. good. Mm -hmm. It's like when you get three spells in your graveyard, you should win that match 100% of the time, even if you like don't rip off engage like in the beginning. Yeah. But the main reason why I think these cards are good, like, uh, is because if you're playing against Thunder Dragon, you need to get three spells in your graveyard, and if you have this, this will get you there. Um, I just think these cards are really good, and I think Metaphor's Fusion is really good. Like that extra Metaphor's draw Fusion is, is like really the good. best card to draw, I think, because like when you have multi roll, you never want to pop a real card. You always want to pop. You want to draw like cards like this to like pop, because then like the second effect is really good, but then like sacrificing a real card to use the effect is not that worth most of the time. Yeah, so it's really but good. yeah, I really like this engine. Uh, and then we played one Rota. So I played one Upstar Goblin. This is the yeah. only play place where our list differs. Yeah. Uh, Kenny played two Shared Ride instead of this, but. Yeah. Uh, I play, I ended up playing Upstart because Mirko told me it's like another spelling grave and it's the same thing versus Thunder Dragon. Thunder Dragon is a scary matchup sometimes, yeah. but the more free spells you have in grave, it's, it's like the, the easier the matchup gets. And then against my boy Kenny right here, I, yeah, I upstarted to engage, into engage and that was game. I, was like, yeah, um, was I really good. like this card. Uh, I think Shared Ride is good, but in this I format... I should have played that. I didn't really like Shared Ride that much. Yeah, so I, I liked Upstart a lot. Uh, yeah. So yeah, and then the last three spells we played were just three Twin Twister. Uh, 
It's pretty standard. I mean, this card's just so good. It's a blowout in the middle. Yeah, this card's a nuts. You always want to see it. Yeah, and then the only traps we played were just three impermanence. Just we need that extra hand trap because of all the this wasn't combo decks. I went against one uh, Thunder Dragon. I opened fucking like I saw my opening hand. I didn't know I didn't know it was playing Thunders. I opened two of these and a Widow Anchor and like I break. And then like freaking he makes triple Colossalus and I'm like okay, double these Widow Anchor go Rota. Yeah, and permanence is just really, it's just very versatile, and that's what yeah. makes it good. Like, you're playing six Widow Anchors in your deck because yeah. of this. And it's not even bad against Mirror. It's, it's not great against Mirror, but then, like, stop the <coughs> Shizu with this. It's like, okay, even Kagari, like, sometimes. Some yeah, thing. and permanence is good. I really liked it. Uh, that's it for the main deck. I played yeah. 40, he played 41, since he played two Shared Ride instead of uh, Upstar. For the extra deck, played uh, one Clara yeah. because never of. Never came um, up for me, but Village, yeah. Yeah, Village. Mm -hmm. uh, Phoenix, never summoned this. Yeah. Oh, I actually summoned this once because I took my opponent's Titan and I just summoned this. I summoned this once because one of my opponents, he, he's playing True Draco and I asked his demise and he asked me if I can use another one. So I knew there was a demise set, so I'm like, okay, summon this guy, pop your demise. <laughs> That's the only time I ever used it. Yeah, I never used the effect, but I mean, yeah. it's, it's good to have in your extra deck. Uh, Unicorn, I never summoned this. Nah, I didn't summon that today. Uh, Ningirsu, I never summoned this, but this is a good card to have in your extra deck. Mm -hmm. uh, like the best card in my extra deck today, I Bomber Dragon. I should have played that. Uh, yeah. A guy tried to full Goki board me because, but I had uh, Eagle Booster, so he couldn't get rid of my Shizuku. Next turn, I Widow Anchor his his uh, tri Trigate. I make this, and then I Hornet Jones, and I clear his board, and now I won the game because of this. I'm very happy I played this. Uh, this card was insane for me. Very, very good. Uh, play Boros Sword. I, I never, never summoned. Yeah, it. I never yeah. summoned. This is kind of hard to summon. It's good, but, but it's actually hella hard to summon. You know, like Shark Cannon, like a Link Two or Three. Yeah, most but, of the time to make. It. I mean, it's a good card, but yeah, I didn't summon this. And then for the yeah. Sky Striker, I played three. Uh, I think it's a sta it's staple for everybody to play three. Of these I now. see people play two of this at London. There was like two or three lists that played two of this. I don't get it. Yeah, dude. I think like, three is really good. A lot of times you want to go like area zero. You don't hit anything to summon Hayate first in case you hit Engage. Mm -hmm. And if you play like two, then that just doesn't make any sense because that play comes up a lot. Yeah, and then uh, obviously the standard three Shizuku and three Kugari. That's it for the extra deck. And now for the side deck, I don't know if our side decks were the same. I think they're uh, similar. Our, our side is the same. Yeah. yeah. yeah All right. So we cited three draw uh, for yeah. combo decks, mainly the FTK, but it's just good against Goki as well. It's not that bad against Goki, especially now because Goki's they play dangers now too, so they got even better. So the a different uh, difference from Mirko's list, I only played two Metaion. Uh I just didn't have a third secret, and I didn't want to get a third secret. Uh, so this that's why that I only played two. Me. Yeah, I I, against it, it the okay. Thunder Dragon, I never drew it, and I yeah. still won, so... Yeah, I'm, exactly. Like, I just had impermanence. Was like, yeah, yeah, so I mean, it's fine, I guess. Uh, three Mind Control. Uh, I didn't side this in versus the mirror. I never drew it versus the mirror, so it didn't matter. I, I actually I never drew it in the mirror. Yeah, either. I never sided this in today. I mean, it's very good in theory. I sided it a lot. I never saw it. I just, uh, yeah. I, it just never came up for me today. But I mean, yeah. it's like, you kind of have to play this card just because of the Thunder Dragon deck. Yeah. And then uh, two Storm Duster, this card was insane. Yeah. It, it just won me my, my match against Kenny right here. Uh, so he had two set. Dude, I, I played around one. I was like, I think I can win if it's not another one. He had both. So, yeah, yeah, Storm Duster is very good. Uh, and then the reason why I also didn't play the third Medallion and players, Super Poly. Please freeze play. I repeat, please freeze play. We played uh, two Mind Crush. Uh, I think this card's like. <laughs> this card's really good. Versus the FDK, when they reveal a danger, if you call that danger, they have to discard it so they don't get the draw. And the, the effect still has to resolve, so you still get to discard one more card. So they lose two cards out of their hand and they don't get to draw. Yeah, and then, it's like a good two for one. Yeah, it's card. And then it's also like, you can hit evenly, you can hit engage, you can hit like trick this, this cards. This is the reason why I went first against you in the mm -hmm. mirror, because like I knew that like if I could like turbo through my engine, I can set this and if you go battle phase, I can do Yeah, that. I think yeah. I think this card is really, really, really good. Um, I'm very happy we played it. And then the last just mm. three side cards are just... Very evenly for, for some like, reason, I never resolved this card except for today. I drew, it was the best time today because I don't think anyone expected this weekend. I had it once and I drew three of it, so I lost. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, anyways, yeah. that's the list. Uh, mm -hmm. I don't know what my final standings and I finished next one, so finish I know I top. Yeah, you lost round one, so you probably get like yeah, I'll probably, fifth or something. I'll come or in top eight, but yeah, eight, so yeah, it's yeah. my first regional top. I'm like so yeah. happy, and it's very nice to get one at my first regional with my new team, uh, E Man Games. So, first mm -hmm. off, yeah, gotta give a huge shout out to E Man, my new team. Mm -hmm. uh, Mirko, of course, you know, I love you. Thank you for the help so much. Uh, shout out to my boys, Nico, Francisco, Caesar, Guzman. We finally got that top, boys. Let's go. Um, that's it for me. Kenny, you have yeah. any shout outs you want to give? Oh, uh, yeah, for sure. I'd like to shout out uh, Marcus Ani from uh, San Jose, uh, San Jose player. Uh, he let me the entire deck. Uh, every single card in it I don't, doesn't belong to me, so it's all his. And then shout out to the people who wrote up with me uh, Bruce uh, behind the camera, Sean right here and uh, Gospel, and then shout-outs to Cal, also a uh, UCCG member, and then shout-outs to Team Royalty and uh, our Royalty store because they let me stay at their motel, and then shout-outs to my team, uh, Ultimate Cards TCG, and that'll be it. All right, thank you, guys. Yep.